Hello and welcome to Tech in Style. I'm Spode and today we have something very special for you, the all new Padphone. Here is an exclusive look at the new design that you won't see anywhere else. Now you may remember that ASUS announced its phone and tablet hybrid back at Computex last year, but what we have here has come on leaps and bounds since then. First up, the concept. The Padphone is a stylish Android handset with a difference. Slip it into the Padphone station and it becomes a fully fledged 10 inch tablet. No more deciding whether you want a smartphone or a tablet, you can literally have both. Let's look at the phone first. It's a pretty tasty looking handset that takes design cues from the Zenbook and Transformer. At the front is a bright 4.3 inch super IPS screen and round the back you'll find an 8 megapixel camera and flash. Down the left hand side are some cleverly positioned ports that allow it to slip into the back of the Padphone station and become a tablet. When it's docked, both the pictures and sound will automatically switch to the bigger screen and speakers on the station. Once it's in place, apart from the cover at the top, you'd be hard pressed to know it wasn't a dedicated tablet. As an added bonus, the station has an internal battery, effectively doubling the life of your phone. You can even charge the station separately, and when you dock the phone, it will top up its battery from the tablet's reserve power, so it will be fully charged when you take it out. As the Padphone runs Ice Cream Sandwich, which is the first release of Android that supports both phones and tablets, the really clever bit is it will switch modes depending on whether it's docked or not. Called Dynamic Display, this nifty trick engineered by ASUS means that the screen will seamlessly flip from phone to tablet mode and back as you dock and undock it. In fact, Dynamic Display is so cool, we're going to be doing an entire episode on it, so make sure you subscribe on YouTube or iTunes if you want to see it in action. Until then, I'll just be switching between pad and phone.